today I'm going to show on how to use softless free online screen recorder. Okay, so you can use it to record the screen of your PC. Maybe you are giving tutorial. Also, it works in iPhone. So if you have an iPhone, you can still use it in your iPhone to record the screen of your iPhone, whereby you guide somebody on how to do a particular thing. All right. This software is developed by Nablamind. So they know what they are doing. They have a team of software developers who work at the back end to add beautiful features to this software over time. To access the software's free online screen recorder, developed by Nablamind, the first thing you need to do is to open your web browser. So I'm using Chrome here, so I'll double click on it for it to open. As your browser opens, visit nablamind.com forward slash screen hyphen recorder i have the link in the description so go click there to be taken to the website you can see the url here okay so after you have typed this link press the enter key of your computer keyboard once this opens this is the page you will see as I said before, this is free to use. Okay, so you can download now and install it on your Windows PC. If you want to check prices, you can click here. Maybe you want to go pro. Okay, then you can see the platforms where you can use this. You can use it for Windows. This is Windows symbol, Windows PC, Apple PCs, which is Mac, and you can get it also from Apple Store that is the App Store. So if you are using the, an iPhone, you can get it from App Store and start using it. Okay, okay. So without taking much time, let's try this for free. So follow along and click on Try for Free. You can see the software is now downloading into our PC, and now it is done downloading. So let's go and open it and install it fully. So I minimize this. Then I'll open the file explorer of my computer. Here I'm using Windows PC. So if you're using Mac, it may be a different thing, okay? But just follow along, okay? So I'll click the downloads folder here. This is the software screen recorder installer I just in, uh, downloaded from my web. So I'll double click on it and give permission for this to install on this PC. So I'll click on install. It's showing me something still. Softly screen recorder, record, edit, and share your on screen brilliance. Okay, as you can see on the screen, the installation is done. That's why it says, Congratulations! Softly screen recorder installation completed successfully. So, click on this button, start now. So, here it's showing us the prices one month license 9.95, this lifetime license 39.95. So I can select any. I said, do you want to allow public and private network to access this app? Allow. So it detected that I'm using Windows PC. So if you're using Mac, it will detect that as well. So let's make progress. As this interface opens, look at this part. You can see the software open here by this um, taskbar section. Okay. So I'll click on that to show up. So you can see some options here. It says full screen select region webcam sound so you have different options on what you want to record so if you want to record full screen you go with this option and that is what i want us to experiment with let me minimize this okay so now the full screen option has been selected now let's record something so for you to start your recording click on record button then wait till the count of five good now our screen has started recording so maybe i want to talk to you about um, file explorer i'll say okay maybe i want to talk to you about yeah file explorer so i'll say okay to access file explorer click on it at the taskbar once it opens you can see some folders here created by default i can take some steps from there so this is being recorded on the screen as i'm talking now but look at this this is also captured as well look at this here so if you don't want that to be captured, click here, the minimize button, and this is now minimized. So when you're done recording, just like I'm done recording because I've taught you now how to use File Explorer. 
just come down to this section of your Windows PC. I'm using with the okay. I'm using with this 11, so click there, and then you can see the recording icon here. So click on it. It shows up again. You can pause this thing or you can stop. So I have stopped this. And as I have stopped it, you can see now the file is placed here automatically. So you can double click on it for it to open. All right. For you to see what you just did. Okay. Also, if you want to delete the video, you can click on this delete all. Or you can click on this button here. If you have a lot of videos here in this um, storage, you can click here and select the delete option. All right. So let's now do it. I'll click here. I said, do you want to delete? I can delete it. So let me just delete it. All right. Or let me just leave it. Okay. Let me just cancel it. So to return to home, click on return to home. Now we have returned to home. Now, if you want to record a section or a region of your PC, you can do that. Okay. So for you to use region, click on this region, uh, drop down here. As you click on that, just go with the option fist region or go with this one and then press and hold on the left button of your mouse to select the region you want to record on your pc and start recording all right so that is that for region so we have webcam as an option here so you can record webcam for you to do that click on that and then select hp wide version hd camera it may differ depending on the type of PC you are using. So let's experiment. You can see this has started capturing my picture here. You can see how I look. Okay. So now I can click on record. So it has started capturing. Hello, guys. I hope you are fine. Okay. Let me minimize this so that it will not intercept with the recording. Hello, guys. I hope you are fine. Today I'm going to walk you through on how you can do a lot of things. Ensure you subscribe to Godwin Tech. Please subscribe to Godwin Tech. It's very important. I know why I'm saying that, okay? So this has now captured the screen of this PC as well as this, my camera here, my picture here, show right away. After that, click here and then select it. And then I will then stop. Or you can still pause it to continue later. This is a nice feature. Clipture doesn't have that. That's another uh, video editor. So I'll stop here. I'm done. All right, as I have stopped, you can see this file is placed here automatically. So I can play it by double clicking on it. All right. Okay, so let's return to home to see other things we can do. So I'll click on return to home. All right, the sound is there already. So a microphone is selected by default. If I want to choose system sound, system sound and microphone or record without audio. Okay, anyone can go. All right, so it's a choice. The tier microphone is chosen because my microphone is connected to my PC already. Okay, then let's talk about some other things. Here is the help. Maybe you want to need help. You need help from uh, the developers. Just go through this button here. If you want to upgrade to full version, just click here and you'll be taken to a page for you to upgrade. Then settings, very important. So these settings contain some things you need to know about this software, how it's set by default, but you can change it from there. So let's click on settings button. So here now it shows you output folder. That is where your file is saved. Any video you are recording with this software is saved in the PC storage and in a folder called softless screen recorder. So let's check out. So I'll click on my file explorer. Then I'll click on this PC and then I'll double click here. Once I double click, I'll see softless screen recorder and I'll double click. You can see the videos I have already captured here. You can see, so it's clear. So the next one here is language. So now it's showing us that the selected language is English. Video, okay, this is the video format. Output format is MP4. If you want something different, click here and select another format of your choice. But I'm okay with MP4. Then a quality HD default is selected. That is HD is selected by default. If you want something different, click there. And then maybe go with ST, space saving, or original, which is high quality. So it's your choice. All right. So HD is cool. Then 
the frame rate 30 is selected by default okay so if you want to change it click there and select another uh, frame rate of your choice but i'm okay with 30 and then click ok for everything to be saved so if you don't want to access the videos you recorded already through the file explorer as i showed you you can come here and click on video list okay once you click on there you can see the list of videos you recorded if you want to get back to home click on get to home so this is just a simple tutorial on how you can use this great free to use application so make use of it and enjoy it as it lasts i hope you find this guide helpful please if it does help consider subscribing to my channel by hitting the subscribe button when you subscribe and i produce a new video you get notification on that so you come over and watch the video to learn more on technology okay when this in our world of today we're around technology so get as much as you can to grow in the field of tech all right also hit that like button for the video to go viral and leave a comment if you have any you can also support this channel if you want to do so i have buy me a coffee link in the description below so you can buy me a coffee to support what i do after recording your video with softwares you may need to edit the video further and microsoft clipchamp can do that for you so watch this video to learn how to use clipchamp video editor see you next time